So how was your feeling when you saw all the crowd yesterday cheering for Mansour? Well, it was amazing. Um, I've never had anything like that in my life. Last year in Jeddah for the Greatest Royal Rumble, I was uh, hoping to be in WWE. I was trying to be in WWE. I did my tryout and now I'm finally here one year later and I got to be in a match and compete in a match. And not only that, but I won the 50-man battle royal. It's the largest battle royal in WWE history. There's never been that many people, that many people in that ring. And um, when I won and I saw the crowd, I, my brother Talal was there, uh, a boy, uh, uh, and, and I ran over to them and I jumped and I, and I wanted to be in the crowd because I wanted to celebrate with everyone. Because I want to show everyone that what I'm doing in the ring in WWE is something they can do. If that is their dream, if that is what they aspire to do, if that is, is what they want in their heart, it, they can do it. I'm very uh, blessed and privileged because here in Al Memlika, there's no wrestling school. There's no way to go into WWE if you want to be, be a Musara. Um, I was living in America and I was able to train and prepare because it was always my dream since I was a child. Living in uh, Riyadh, I wanted to be a, a wrestler so badly. So in America, I got the opportunity to train. And then for my tryout in Jeddah with WWE, well, I was, I was, Zaghir. I was very small. <laughs> Everyone was so big. They had giant muscles, bodybuilders or football players. And, but I wanted it so much more than anyone else I wanted it. So I pushed and I, I lifted and I ran faster and more. And when my heart said, khalas, I'm done. When my body said, khalas, I'm done. I said, no, I will finish. My ambition is to be the first Saudi WWE champion. I want to be someone who can hold a title, who has a belt, and I can hold it in Jeddah or Riyadh or uh, not already. Uh, well, not. <laughs> I, I need the hell. You know, like I need. I, I want. I want people to see someone like them hold something like that because it means so much. Because when I was a child, I didn't think I could be here because there was no one like me. Not just Saudi, but anyone from the Middle East to represent uh, us positively and that is my dream. Oh sure, so uh, 50 men start in the ring and you have to throw them over the top rope. There are three ropes. So you have to throw them over until you are the last person, the last wrestler in the ring. And if you win, you are known as the man, the Musara, who won the biggest ever battle royale. There has never ever been 50 men. That is the That's most, the first, that is, first, first ever time. The ring was was bending because there were so many people and so much weight that the ring maybe couldn't hold, but it held and, and then we threw people out and I just want, I had to survive because there are so many people, legends that were in that ring with me. There are so many legend Undertaker, like, you know, uh, Seth Rollins, Kofi Kingston. These are men that I look up to, that I, that I respect, but I also want to compete with. So I will train very hard and I will do my best so that I can one day reach the level that they are on so I can compete with them. When I watched the match and I won, there was a clip of a child crying because that child, he looked like me when I was a child. And the fact that when I was a child, I never got to experience seeing someone like me do the thing that I love, wrestling. To be the person, the first person, that can bring everyone in to see, like, this is WWE, this is for, this is for us. That's what I want to represent.